All right, the map is world, and we are spectating another match of Territorial I.O. Greetings and hello. How are you feeling? How are you doing? The mic needs to go a little bit farther away from the mouth there. I want to get those plosives going on. We're chilling. We're vibing. Got uh, Indy over here. Got the crown full sending. Getting wrecked. They didn't conserve their troops at all. AFK's attacking us, that's fine. Go ahead and finish the job there, would ya? Get us out of here. Get me out of here, you. If I attack him enough, they'll like push us out. Those numbers off my screen. Get out of here, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Attack these people. Somebody take me out. Thank you. If you attack them enough, they eventually push you out. <laughs> I guess we influence the game a little bit, but there isn't a proper spectate mode, right? All right. What's happening, boys? This guy got this guy left. Okay, we're chilling. Peppa Pig over here is happening. I need to figure out what the heck to talk about and commentate about on the first like two or three minutes. Because honestly, the first two or three minutes. Hey, look, it's Roxy and Smart Fridge user. The first two or three minutes are basically the. Uh, eh, there's not much to talk about. Some guy said, uh, some, somebody left a comment. There's Vietnam boy again. Um, she plays Bosnia. Uh, somebody, uh, left a comment on the on one of my videos today saying, Hey, I'm smart for user. I'm smart for user. And I wasn't, uh, stream sniping. And then here I am, you know, 20 minutes in my stream and I'm already seeing the name again. So either they just play the game like constantly or whoever wrote that comment was lying to me. <laughs> or they just like to play the game at the same time as I stream and uh coincidence i don't know um cg censorship <laughs> i mean i i do i do approve of censoring um bad names in the game i do like if somebody has hate speech for name i think that should be censored and not allowed in the game that's kind of standard practice for most multiplayer games is to not let toxic trolls spread hate th via usernames and I stand by that as being the correct thing to do. One, as being a decent human being. And two, as like as a content creator, I'm held to certain community guidelines by YouTube as far as like what is, is and is not acceptable to be put on my channel. Hate speech is a very clear violation of YouTube. So even if so, even those of you out there who are like, eh, freedom of speech, we should be able to say anything we want in any context. Not on YouTube, brother. <laughs> Not on YouTube. You can get yourself banned off the platform. You see the wrong things. So, also for just for those who aren't aware, um, freedom is the whole freedom of speech thing. That actually means freedom of speech from like government consequences. Private businesses can restrict what you say all they want on like you know, if somebody makes a website, you can't just go on there and be like, I'm free to say whatever I want on there. No, they can delete your username off their website all they want because it's a private business. The freedom of speech only legally in America legally applies to like from the government, not like private businesses. For those of you who are not aware of the legalities of that, all that stuff, not that anybody cares. Flanders is doing really well for themselves down here. Troop count seems a little bit low for the four minute mark, but maybe these guys are low as well. No, their troop count is actually fantastic. So I get the feeling they got some free land maybe. Or they, can serve, or they can serve their troops better? Who knows? This guy's getting pushed out. Australia's getting consolidated at a pretty halfway decent rate. The question is... No, I mean, yeah, Waddle's got more land there and more troops than this. I feel like Otto's going to consolidate uh, Australia at a pretty quick rate, which is going to be pretty good for them, actually. Because they'll get this, they can carve their way through here, and it's not bad for themselves, actually. Not bad at all. Hmm. This guy's actually did a nice job of getting Alaska and uh, Western U.S. right there. It's pretty good. Cringe Aryan Empire. <laughs> All right. Um, hmm. Never ceases to amaze the new names people come up with. This cum meep guy is just kind of screwed, really. Ooh, Zany was working on something down there. Oh, that, never mind. They got some free land there. This guy was over here and here, and they're getting attacked, and now Meep gets all that. That's actually great for Meep. This is also good for Furnace over here. That's not a very nice name. Um, well, welcome to Territorial I.O. You can't play one game without some horrible name in it. All right. Kind of chilling and vibing over here. I guess, to be fair, what do you expect? There's probably, you know... It's 12-year-olds it's, it's trying to be edgy that use names like this. 
Nobody, nobody other than like a wannabe edgy 12 year old would use a name like that. Just saying. They're working this guy right here. Flanders is doing great over there. Waddle is consulting this. Although the hat guy, name I saw the other, I saw, I've seen a lot of the same names. Um, well, I guess we got a lot of return uh, viewers that want to get uh, the attention. I like to try and get in the lobbies. Stream sniping or trying to get the matches is not so bad when I'm spectating. Just don't do it when I'm actually playing the game. Not that most of you will listen. Most of you won't, because you're sociopaths like that, some of you. Not all of you. Plan is doing well over here. Mm hmm CG, what do you mean they're sociopaths? They're not all of them, not all of them. But if somebody specifically tells you, please don't try to stream snipe me, and you do it anyway, that's sociopathic behavior because you're ignoring what other people want and focusing on what you want, which is what sociopaths do. They don't care about other people's desires or feelings. They only care about, about their own. A little bit of word explanation for you all there. A I'm noticing a lot of time people in South America like to bypass going up this and bolt their way into this and up into here. And that's a play that I've got mixed feelings about, like constantly. Like right now, it kind of makes sense because this guy's huge. So like, I kind of get it. A lot of times, eh, not so much. I kind of want him to like consolidate this first, but then again, like right now, like, right now it kind of makes this this play kind of makes sense. You don't want this guy to consolidate all of North America, then go against you, because like your concern is that he consolidates this faster than you can take out this, and then you have a struggle struggle beating him. So by getting some of it from him, you limit his growth. This guy's getting away with murder over here. Um, it's not good for anybody unless they can deal with him. Um, I want to see Waddle bolt their way up along all this and attack them with these guys work together, but might not happen. Cold Potato is full sentiment, lower their troops a little bit. Unless these guys all we got one, two, three, four, five. If just two or three of them start ganging up on him together, he's screwed. But uh, the problem Flanders has is um they might actually end up uh I see Roxy all the time uh, in my uh, matches. If uh, they uh, yeah see this is the problem Flanders have is by going up here now they got you attack them they got you attack them they might attack them. Just like just not gonna work well for you. That's why that's why I like I never see this play work out. The whole South America, either have full of it or half of it, and boat up to here and just bypass this. It just never seems to work out because look what's happening. They're all ganging up on you. Get South America and go across here and go up this way. Unless they're really big and then maybe try something like this. But yeah, because now is like now instead of having to fight one or two, you're now fighting all four of these guys, which doesn't work out great for you. Oh, this guy just seems to be kind of chilling there. Maybe he's attacking them a little bit, but... Yeah, you're fighting a, a 4v1 right now that could be a 2v1 or a 1v1. So, I don't think Flanders deserves to win this match because they made a huge misplay by just... Like, they could have... These guys could have stalemated him for a while, I think. And you could have had South America secured, and then... While he's working on those, you tap him in the back. And now, you, now you're just helping Zany out at this point. You're just helping him out at this point. And uh, this guy's still going crazy. And, and you're boating into Africa right now? Oh my god, Flanders, you don't deserve to win at all. I think you just got lucky to get this much land. Because you're making misplay after misplay after misplay. I do see Waddle trying to work their way up here, but a little bit late here. I don't think, uh... I don't think really... I don't think anybody's going to be able to, like, take this guy down. He's too big. Unless somebody's willing... Okay, this guy full sent because he's getting wrecked. I mean, the only real chance of this guy losing is if somebody consolidates this quickly. That's so good for user 206, though. And they boated over into Africa over there. Now, unless these guys really, like, now is the time to gang up on this guy. Otherwise, it's over. Um, this, like, this over here, this is going to take a while. Unless this this guy gets impatient and full sends or something, or, or like, this is gonna, this is going to take a hot minute. Roxy actually boated their way down here and got a piece of this. Interesting, attacking a zany a little bit. Don't think it's gonna matter though. I think this is gonna be a unless these guys, unless these two guys and Waddle all work together against this guy, it's just done. Country Club is getting body nah, I thought Even if they all work together, I don't think these guys are big enough to stop him. And these guys are just still over here, twiddling their thumbs, trying to like get the yeah. Roxy knows is over. They're putting the sun the surrender sign up. And this guy's just carving through little by little. Waddle's trying to like yeah. Waddle's doing little boat strats over here, getting a bit of this. This guy's just kind of chilling, vibing. 206 is not helping the scenario by attacking him at the same time Roxy's getting in on it. I mean, I guess it kind of helps because you limit how much he gets and maybe these guys can like fight each other while these one, two, three, four work against him. Roxy and 206 have got some they got so much though. They've got as much as like the top four like combined. 
I'm not sure anybody can stop him at this point. Can it be stopped? Can anybody put a stop? Yep. It's a little late to be signaling that. Where were you when he was getting attacked? Where were you when he was getting attacked? You could have boated across and done something. It's like Waddle's... Oh, well, Waddle's done like no troops here. Oh, that guy left, so that's more land for them. That's both good and bad, because I highly anticipate they're probably going to start stabbing these guys in the back. Which ain't going to help the case over here. Uh, you guys, is anybody, are you, is anybody attacking these guys who's kind of like chilling and letting him uh, build up? He's down to 8 million troops. He's down to 8... Oh, he's got 13 million, never mind. Ah, uh, yep, they're doing the thing where they play for second place, gotcha. Alright, so... Is there any chance... Waddle's gone, he's slowly getting Australia. 206 seems to have little to no interest in attacking you. They're actually more focusing on them. No. Uh, I'm, uh, I think we'll end the video here, because it's clearly going to be... Uh, for, I don't really like this guy's name, but unfortunately they're going to be the one who wins here. Um, smash the like button if you like Territorial I.O. and you will see more of it on this channel. Let's go.